So Extravagant is a song that is elevating and describing my personality and all of my vivaciousness. I wrote it because I was dating this dude and I remember him saying like, I do too much, I'm way too loud. Like basically I need to calm down or chill out and I just was not gonna do that. And I remember just like laying down with him and be like, you're really extra. And I was like, yeah. Yeah, like that's what I'm always gonna be. But people have been telling me that since I was literally three years old. So it's never gonna change. And I made a song about it to kind of elevate that moment because he was trying to diminish me and I was not gonna let it happen. If you cannot afford me, then just say that. Real rich run my way and I don't play that. We shit big old step up from VA, gon' grow up, they throw dirt up on my name. Vocal, vibrant, vivacious, very hot, I'm way too sexy and it's scary. Diamonds on me, yellow, that canary. Give it off your list that you ain't used to. Um, that first stanza, it's like if you, after that conversation, it's like if you're intimidated by me, just go ahead and be honest about it. Because it's not that you don't like me, it's not that you're mad at me, it's not that we're not compatible or that we don't even get along. But some people really be in the room with you and be intimidated because you're really being yourself. And so I just had to, if you cannot afford me to just say that, I just had to get it out the way up front. Like, if that's the problem, just be honest about it instead of making it about something else. And I also learned that sometimes when you're irritated by a person's personality or the things that they're doing is because of something in them that you really want to be able to do or accomplish. And so like in moments like that, even when I feel that about somebody else, it's like, okay, what about them got me out of my skin? It's probably because they're doing something that they have a little more confidence in me to do. So we got that out the way up front. If you can't afford it, just say that. Just... My presence pressure, it is all level my son. Tell me where are you feeling that son? Get it together. You shouldn't ever compete where you cannot measure. Versus cuts up on my clavicle. We not equal lateral type. You got to take the latitude. Still can't get up on my latitude. I have to have a double alliteration because we still rap at the end of the day. But vocal, vibrant, vivacious, very beautiful. It's like... I just have this je ne sais quoi, this, this energy about me that I really believe is a beautiful thing and understanding that I have that I know that I could like positively put that there so some other person who may not be feeling like that that day can say that and they just come alive. Like at the end of every song of mine, you're gonna feel empowered. Tip, don't be on your phone when you walk into a room. When you walk into a room, put your phone down, have your head up, roll them shoulders back, and walk straight in and then watch how everybody just started to pay attention is because that is when you're walking with confidence. Energy and that attitude when you're confident, you're sure of yourself can be intimidating. But it's not, it's not like this cocky, weird, nasty thing. It's coming from a place of love and truth. And that can be inspiring. Like we just had to pop my shit. Like I just had to pop my shit real quick. So <laughs> um, I, I really do believe this. I'm not in competition with anybody in the world for anything. Not a spot, not a job, not a position, not a stage I'm competing for because what God has for me is really for me. So if you put yourself in a position where you're competing with me, when God has already laid stuff out for me, you compete with God at that point. You're not really competing with me. So. Cause a bitch gonna always say cause she can't. His infatuation with me kinda quaint. Don't recognize the old version is pain. Swear we curvy, I will glass we get a run Virginia, we inflated with swing. Had a gloopy, can't you tell by the stain? Not an actress, don't get paid to be fake. My price of cuz yesterday, they to days. I swear I drama and she be like it's a tank. Really by my bank, not gonna all the competition, I feel like hey, coming up in rank, golden in my state, I'm just being frank. I make bitch a million on the table like he playing. I bring all the boys to me, y'all got them thirsty for my drink. I don't wait for opportunities I take. I don't need your spot. I'm gonna elevate. Wait. Somebody's always gonna be hating somewhere. But it's again, it's not because they really hate you. It's because there's something that they want that they just don't have yet. So you never see a person like that and be mean to them. You have to express love and compassion and have empathy for that foolishness. You know what I'm saying? I'm giving you gorgeous, giving you done, and giving what's supposed to be gay. I'm giving you healthy, giving you wealthy. The good that's causing the rape. Now they wanna be friend haze. Ride my wave, stalk my page, learn my ways. I'm not giving too much, you're just not doing enough, so please get out of my way since I'm so. At that point of the song, I really was just trying to have more fun and be a little bit more playful and like talk about 
all the different things that I think are extravagant, that I think are great. Even people like, I'm, I name dropped Donna Summers. Um, I know like Hank was Hank Aaron. Like I was trying to think of, oh, and I know I mentioned, uh, let's say words. Like I was just trying to find different ways to like add stuff in, like what's fly, what's gonna be like a bounce, like what what's the bar that might go over somebody's head? Like, so that's why I was just, like, I dropped my issue, like it's a tank, woo, my bag, not gonna all the competition. I feel like Hank, Coming up in rank, what? Go to the mistake? I'm just being frank. What? That's, that was crazy to me. And I was hyped. I literally threw my phone after we finished recording it. He said, I'm extra. And then I agree, say I'm extravagant, expensive, into lavish it, extensive with my finance. I'm extra. Big about my business and my bag again. My profession includes stepping on bitches and being bad. So, move on to my favorite part of the song. You know, extra, listen. Then I agree to have extravagant. Literally was sitting next to this man and was like, extravagant, get it together. We don't just say extra no more, it's extravagant. Cause if it's gonna be that, it's really gonna be that. It's kinda, I just was talking about what that means. Like, I'm expensive. Like, I like to live a certain way. I like to have a certain quality. I just want my, my, it, it, this started to happen the older I got. Like, I enjoy different thread counts, different types of fabrics. I really like a lot of color. I like being very bright. And even on days where I'm like this, where I'm just like chilling, there's no way I'm not gonna have some color somewhere or something that's just like extra fly. So I just laid it out. Like this is what it is, just being extravagant. This is what it's gonna look like. This is what it's gonna feel like. And I just wanted to make sure I had the soundtrack for that vibe. The whole song is just like a big empowerment moment. So. Like, we need your car, we need your friends, we have to party, play it. Like, watch the whole, watch the scene go up. Like, it really is not anything that is supposed to be, like, mean or shy or anything like that. It's a song that I made to empower myself in that moment when somebody was trying to make me feel this small. And so because he tried to make me feel this small, I had him realize that I'm really that big. You want me to scream?